Hey guys, this video I'm pretty excited to share with you because I think this is the best feature that's come out in QuickBooks Online in the last year. It is the ability to pair credit card payments with a corresponding checking account payment. And you're going to notice now in your QuickBooks account that when it sees a credit card payment and you've linked to the bank feeds, you're going to see an option uh, that says paired to another transaction. And what that means is that it sees money in to the check, uh, credit card account, money out from the corresponding business checking account, and it magically can take care of both of them at the same time when you add the credit card payment. So here we've got money coming into the credit card. And let me share with you how the screen would look when we're looking at the checking account. So on the checking account, you can open up, you can see the paired transaction details. It says when you confirm, we'll record this credit card payment going in and out. So you'll see the impact on both accounts. So uh, that's a mouthful, but trust me, this is, this is an awesome, awesome experience here. Let me demonstrate now with my demo account. Okay, so we have this 1507 amount here and I'm, I'm in my checking account and this is money out on January 19th okay and you can see that's pairing up with another transaction January 20th so the bank feeds might have one or two days difference on when the payment was scheduled out of the checking account and when it hits the credit card account right so I'm gonna click on the visa and come down here and see uh, let's sort by dates. There we go, right here. And I click on this one, and I can see that it has um, it has matched it there. So I can simply click Add Credit Card Payment. Boom! And what will happen here is it will take care of both of them at the same time. You can come up here. I can see that it says two online banking matches. I can see an audit history and it shows, um, you know, in one shot, it was recorded at 826 today. Both of those are on there. <laughs> That's just awesome. Also pay attention to our numbers here. We have 53 visa and we have 24 checking. So. I'm going to go to the Visa. I'm going to record two more credit card payments. And watch how watch the number here on that. So, if, you know, I'm looking at this. I'm going to pair it up. 1217, that's going to get paired. And I have to refer let me just do this real quick here then I'll refresh. No, you don't you don't ever want to rule now. There's no need for rules with these pairings anymore. So, don't do rules. In my opinion, I'm going to refresh. And this checking account here should go down to 22 transactions. Okay. <laughs> Just awesome. So that's going to help you out keeping your credit card payments confirming up there. So we're not experiencing duplicate transactions, which I saw lots of people doing. And um, let me know in the comments what you think about this new feature here to pair your credit card uh, payments. One little side note is that this also would work with, say you had a connected savings account and you transfer money from your checking account to the savings account. It's going to do the same thing. It's going to pair up transfers, just straight up bank transfers. So that's also awesome too. Um, it, it can be for any money moving in and out of a connected bank account that's con connected to the bank feeds. Hey guys, thanks for watching. See you see you in the next video.